We are on our way to the store to TJ Maxx because we got to get you at, well, we want to celebrate getting 500 subscribers. Celebrate. We got to celebrate. <laughs> yeah. Celebrate. Yay. 500 subscribers. Say <laughs> Say yay. Yay. <laughs> oh my. 500 subscribers. You like us. Uh -huh. You really like us. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. So anyway, we're going to T-Max. We gotta uh, pay some bills. And then, uh, he, I have to go to work. And he has to go play football. And then, but before we want to go try to see if we can pick out some stuff that you guys may like. <gasps> I don't know. I hope that, um, you know, we get to do something to show our appreciation for watching us and sticking through us. I know um, I don't know. I just can't believe we got 500. I, when I started this, when we, when I started this channel, actually, I didn't even start it. Let me get going because we'll be late because I have to go to work. Um, my wedding planner actually started this channel. Uh, so what happened was when we were getting married, um, I didn't know how to build a wedding website, and so my wedding planner ended up building the website for us. But she couldn't figure out how to get the videos to show up on the website. So she was, but there was a link on the website for YouTube videos. So she put our uh, engagement videos and our and our brunch and all that stuff on YouTube, so it could be linked to the wedding website. And um, she built the wedding web. She put the video links on the wedding website so that our family and friends can view the video. Because there's a lot of people who don't live in Michigan who were coming to the wedding but weren't able to um, come to the brunch and the engagement party and the surprise proposal, which actually I didn't put the surprise proposal up, you know. I think I have video pictures Your dad that. has it. Oh yeah, my dad has it. I haven't even seen it. Oh, it's horrible. You might not want to see it. <laughs> you wouldn't even... She wouldn't even say yes. It took her forever to say yes. Her dad. I mean, I knew her, 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 her say yes. Her dad talked to her. I just couldn't believe because this is the thing. They made me so so mad. And this when I and it, not only was I mad, my sister played a trick on uh, on me, saying that um, she was yelling at everyone. Me, she wanted to talk to me. But my sister played a trick, saying her house was getting robbed. And so we were rushing over. I'm like, why are we rushing over to meet some burglars? And I'm sitting here scared. I'm already mad. I went from being mad to being scared all within a second. Because we're flying to her house and she's almost like, we gotta meet the cops and the cops on the stair and the burglars still might be in the house. I'm like, is the burglar still in the house? Why are we going there? Like, I just don't understand this. And then she, when we get there, she jumps out of the car and runs towards the door. And I'm like, screaming like, eh, like hey, what are you doing what are you doing but don't go to the car like and then i'm trying to grab any kind of weapon i have in my car so i can run after this chick and make sure that the burglar don't kill my sister <sighs> so i'm running in the door <laughs> and it's them screaming no no actually i ran in the door and it was dark and they had you had a curtain up right you had a they had a curtain up and I'm looking and I hear I hear whispering and I'm like, Ever they're in the house, they're in the house. <laughs> and I pulled a curtain back and I have I don't know, I think I had a I had a you big key. key. You're about to shank, oh you're about to man. And I'm like holding it like this, like I'm about to stab somebody with this big key. <laughs> it is so retarded. Anyways, I'm my heart's beating so fast, like Oh, we're about to die, and it's just me and her. Nobody even knows we're here. It was not, I mean, well, the cops are on their way, but I'm talking about my, my family, my parents don't even know that we're about to die. You know, I don't know. And then I opened the curtain, and everybody screams. There's like 50 people. I'm like, oh my God, it's about to die. My heart. So when he went, wait, when they opened the curtain, he was already down on one knee. And 
I'm like, y'all understand. <laughs> I know it was horrible that I didn't say yes right away, but I'm like looking around. My eyes are huge. My heart is racing. And I'm like, what in the world? What is going on? Who's this? And he's busy on his knee talking to me, and I'm totally not even, not even hearing him. <laughs> and my dad was like, Asia, Asia, he's saying something. And I'm like, man, ask you a question. What? What's going on? I'm like, my dad, like, he's asking you a question. I'm like, what are you talking about? What question? <laughs> <laughs> you guys, this video is bad. I'm like, gosh. Should we tell him what happened a week before how you got all mad at me and and I told you that I got you a ring? Oh, and you asked to spoil your own surprise? You still, you still were surprised. Damn, can you imagine? <laughs> so you would have been surprised a lot more if I didn't tell you I already got the ring. If you thought it was sold out. Yeah. Oh, that's the other thing. So, I had picked out a bunch of different rings, and I did. I didn't want to. I wanted to be surprised. I didn't want him. I don't want to pick my own ring, but I wanted to give him a general idea of what I wanted. But in the meantime, when we finding this particular like different rings for him to look at, I had found a diamond that was over a carrot. That was actually in our price range, and I can't believe I, you know, we bought it from this. Uh, I don't want to say exactly where, but it's like a, it was a really good deal. So it was an online, um, big time, not any fly by night scam. On it's a big online realtor, re retail diamond, diamond retailer that um, basically you cut out the middleman, you can buy the diamonds from them wholesale, and everybody knows about the club. I mean, everybody knows. The, give you a uh, certificate, your ring has a serial number on it, you can make sure nobody steals it from you, and they show you exactly what the diamond looks like from inside and out, and you can get um, a 360 degree view of the diamond, and you can see everything, every flaw. And this particular diamond was a VS, I mean, it, had, it, it was a high grade, I couldn't believe the price of this diamond, I just couldn't believe it because when we went to diamond stores around us, a diamond smaller than this particular diamond uh, was double the price. It's almost like, oh my gosh! So I was like, Brandon, you have to, you know, look at this diamond. Like, even though it's not, it, it's not, it doesn't have to come with a setting. The price of the diamond, we could like buy that, and then later on buy a ring, put a ring on Leway, like the actual setting on Leway. But this diamond is such a good deal, I felt like we had to get it. But um, we had some wedding stuff that came up, so he didn't think that he would be able to pay for it in time. So I was like, I kept watching this diamond. I kept watching, you know, you can watch it, you put a little watch uh, bell on it, just and it'll alert you if somebody's interested in it or somebody bought it. So about, what, a month later, after me watching this diamond every day, oh my God, I'm so obsessed with this diamond. I got an alert saying it was so, oh my God. My heart dropped. I called Brandon right away. I was like, my diamond was so, I said my diamond, like I had already had it. I said my diamond was so, I literally was like in tears because I was, I wanted I was to playing it off. I said, oh, I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'll make it up to you. He told me, oh, don't worry. There'll be other diamonds and you know, don't worry about it. I'll find you something bigger and better and all these different things and I just like I don't want any bigger butter diamond I want that diamond <laughs> I was wanting like a little baby um I don't know I was just crying because I was that I don't know why I was so sold that time it's like when you find that house and you want that house and then you know someone outbids you and you don't get that and you had your heart so you had your heart set on this particular house and you already imagine yourself in the house I already imagined myself wearing this diamond. You know, I don't know why. I, I don't know if it's a woman thing. I don't know, but I literally was in tears because I didn't get this diamond. You know, coming to find out, it was him that purchased the diamond, <laughs> <laughs> and he played it off so good. Oh man, I had no clue. And usually, I can tell when he's lying to me or when he's tricking me because he's not very good at keeping secrets or surprises. He usually tells on himself, you know, a lot. I don't know. 
what do you think we should i don't know what we should get for our subscribers i don't know what they would like and then some of our subscribers are men i'm sorry men i probably end up getting something girly so if you do uh decide to um Maybe, 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 we should, maybe we should ask them what they want. They could uh, tell us. No, the video. I wanted, but, no, I want this to be Monday's video, so that we can already have the contest going by then. But they can just give it to their wives or their girlfriends. And if they don't have wives and girlfriends, you can give it to your mom. I don't know. What should we? What should, what should we get? I don't know. Can't wait to get there. Hopefully, it's something we can afford because we're broke. <laughs> Oh, you there. know where we should no. go? It's go, the food is the same, but the people are. Go to this party store right here. They got really good pizza. Mm -hmm. I'm not eating food from a party store. No, but this one, that, they have... No. Mm -hmm. Sorry. I'm sorry. That, <laughs> he calls me bougie and all this stuff. It's like, I just have certain things I just won't do. Yeah, but I'm like sorry. a famous pepperoni no. rolls. I'm not eating pizza from a gas station or a party store. I don't do that. I don't eat food from gas stations. I'm no, just not gonna happen. No, well, I'm too good. No. Yep. I'm sorry. I have a limit on what I can do, and I'm. It's not, I don't tell him that he can't. I don't make. Whatever, I don't judge other people to eat food at a gas station because he does it all the time. I'm just not going to do it. I just can't. I mean, it makes me sick to even think about eating food. <laughs> like it's like eating fish from Pizza Hut. Why in the world would I go eat some fish at a Pizza Hut? That makes no sense. No. Uh -uh. Mm -hmm. And live and I've worked at fast food. I've worked in restaurants. I've been in the restaurant industry for a while, um, and I see <laughs> the things that are done. And there's certain foods that should not be cooked in certain places because they don't have the equipment to make it right. And then there's they're blending different batters and oils and greases and like it. Like you're not supposed to be cooking fish with burgers and in the same grease. This is disgusting to me. Um, so I just can't do it. I'm sorry. Bougie. We're probably gonna get a thumbs down with a bunch of unlikes because because <laughs> everybody else does it but me. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm not judging you. You eat your fish burgers or your fish that tastes like burgers. I can't do it. <laughs> yeah, that's that's sad. I'm sorry. I can't do it. It's just like when I go to a store. I mean, what things that you guys? There's certain things that you have to have in brand name or something. Like, okay, for me cheese. I have to have the brand name cheese. I can't use the off brand because I don't know why it takes chalky. Um, and it doesn't have to be craft. It just has, well, I prefer craft, but it doesn't have to be. It could be Borden's. It could be anything. It's like certain things. But other things I could do off brand. Like I could do off brand yogurt. I can do off brand cereals. Just fine. But my ketchup has to be Heinz. My cheese has to be brand name. My hot sauce has to be Frank's. No other hot sauce will do, except for when I go to uh, like other Spanish-speaking countries. I like their hot sauce better. Um, and, and I love their hot sauces, but here in the U.S. or in Michigan, it has to be Frank's. Um, there's just certain things that I have to have that particular brand. I don't know why. I, I, and I, it's not like I won't try the other brands. I've tried them. They just don't taste great. I don't know. He'll eat anything. He, well, except for vegetables and fruit. What did I make dinner like? What did I make? Green. You made it, but you didn't eat it. You don't know if I ate any of it. You didn't eat it. Did you eat it? No, but I didn't. Okay, then. Good lord. This is my dog. Say. This is a nice right now, so the other one was no line because it's ghetto and dirty and disgusting. It's probably got rats. Sorry, it probably does. This one's way nicer. I don't know if you guys can see it, but this McDonald's is like way nicer. The other McDonald's is ugh. got broken windows and doors and disgusting trash all over the place. I'm sorry, I can't eat there because I feel like. You can't keep 
your driveway and sidewalk clean, what is it gonna look like in the inside? Like, if you got trash everywhere on the outside, no thank you. I just, mm -mm. gotta be clean. This place, like, this McDonald's is like spick and span clean. It looks almost brand new. It doesn't, I mean, that doesn't necessarily mean anything. They still could be dirty. It's just, to me, it gives me the illusion that they're clean, so I feel better. <laughs> You know, because I'm like, well, if they uh, take the time to clean up outside, I mean, I'm hoping that they take the time to clean up inside. Are you right there? Uh, Alexander the Great? No, that that's one of those restaurants that literally changes every week. Guys, it's so dark. I hope you guys can see us. Yeah, look. That's my hair. I picked it out too much, so now there's like literally no curls, and it's major shrinkage. I ain't never seen this. Look at Oh, they do this all the time. They, they, they're more... I was going to say it's nice here. Good, how are you? Very good. Good to see you. You too, thank you. We're like at the window. You. Huh? Thank you. No Smoothie. problem. How did you get this job? <laughs> Standing outside the door. Well, thank yeah, you. It's nice it's out. Great, it it's a good day to do this. Yeah, you <laughs> thank you. Have a great you too. Bye. He's like standing outside greeting us. That's, See, I told you this that's McDonald's why you is chose, nicer. That's why you chose this one. I know what you're doing. I told you this McDonald's is nicer. You chose this one because you wanted to talk to him. Because they get excellent service. I know it seems like we're a small channel, but to me, 500 seems like a lot. <laughs> Even though not all 500 watch us, I still think. Oh, are they letting you go? I'm letting you go. I still think that. I just feel like, what if all five, if we were to put all 500 right here, right now, I don't even know, I would probably freeze, I probably wouldn't even be able to speak to all of you, but all 500 of you were here in my face right now, would work. You guys have to try it out, because they know that it's a phone, because it's We're always keeping it in here to charge. We'll put it underneath the seat. I gotta change my wallet. I don't like to carry my purse, purse in the car. When I go shopping, I would take this little strappy thing. It's easier. Yeah. Look how nice it is. Sunny. Gosh. I actually don't have to wear my, um, I like this jacket. I don't know if you guys can see it, but I like this jacket. I got it when I went to go visit my sister in California. I don't know if you can see my outfit.
play football with his friends and then I gotta go back out and go to another another TJ Maxx or another store try to find um some more stuff I found a few things I think you guys would like I hope you guys would like for the contest Bye to them. Sure. <laughs> See you later, guys. That's how you think about it. I don't know how I say bye to or to a phone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not used to that yet, Adrian. It's not to a phone. It's to a friend. A YouTube friend. <laughs> What's wrong with you? What is wrong with you? <laughs> Oh my God. I'm trying to see. I can't see myself. I'm tired. I'm tired of being a dark blob. <laughs> You're slow. Slow. Yeah, but I still here for you. A lot. Right. Okay. Yeah, take your trash out of here.
Are you guys ever able to come down this aisle without grabbing something? I swear I come down this aisle every time, ready to go, and I end up buying something. Ooh. Look at the snacks. I shouldn't be getting any of this. But it looks so good. Oh my god, you guys, I am done. I have so much stuff. Look at all this. I don't know if you can see all the stuff that I got for you guys. And there's some stuff in the trunk, too. I had a budget. I had a budget of what I wanted to spend. Because we seriously need to watch what we spend right now. Um, just trying to catch up on things and stay ahead, stay afloat. And... I went way, way over there, but I don't even know why I did it. I just go in there, and you know, I have fun shopping for other people. I like doing things for other people. So when I go in there, like, oh my God, they were like this. And oh my God, they were like this. And I think they were like, then I was sitting there, I sat in there for like, I think I went in the store for four hours, including the two hours I spent with Brandon, and then the two hours after I left him, I spent another two hours in the store. And I was going so crazy, I ended up pulling the saleswoman to the side. I'm like, what, would you like this? Would you like if you, so if, if you were to get a gift from someone, would you want this, this, and this? And she was helping me for so long that <laughs> another lady came over. It's like, when do you want to be able to help me? And I felt so bad. But I just can't wait for you guys to see everything. And hopefully you like it at the end of this video. Um, I know this video is possibly going to be long. I wanted to do another vlog. And I wanted to do another vlog and then also include the giveaway at the end. So I'm going to try to edit it so it's not so long. But it's, this is probably going to be a long video. I apologize. I uh, just had a lot to do. A lot to catch up with Brandon. Me and Brandon hardly ever get to shop together. So we just wanted to have a little fun and talk and just spend time together ourselves and bring you guys along oh man I forgot it's 2 o'clock it's 2.48 guys I want to show you guys what I got I can't wait to get home to open up everything oh my god some stuff was so okay so I'm going to clip in somewhere edit in somewhere in this video I'm going to show you some of the purse choices that I had so one purse was this vegan leather purse beautiful blue color and oh I loved it, it, it even though it wasn't real leather it was vegan leather it was the most buttery soft it felt like real leather but even more buttery that's even a word I don't know but just so soft and the color was so vibrant I just loved it so much and it was the satchel and I love satchels I wear satchels every day just I'm just, I can't believe we made it to 500. I just can't believe it. I just, I'm just sitting here. Especially the, now we're over 500. Like these last 30 subscribers, I didn't even really, no, I went to bed one night. We had, I think we had 501. And I woke up the next day really late. And we had 520. I'm like, damn, we got 20 subscribers overnight. Where did they even come from? But thank you if you're watching. Thank you. Um, I just want to, and I, I wanted to do this contest just to thank everybody because I wouldn't have reached 500 without you, you know, sharing um, our videos, liking our videos, commenting on our videos, mentioning our videos and your videos, um, going on our Instagram posts, tweeting and retweeting. Um, no one else would have even heard about us if you guys weren't sharing about us. And, um, 
promoting us and actually showing real support and watching our videos, liking, commenting. I mean, I get so many comments. I can't believe I just, I love all the comments. I read every comment. I try to read every comment and answer every comment. And I'm sorry if I don't, if I haven't answered your comment or didn't see it. Some of them do end up in spam. Um, and the ones that aren't truly spam, I will approve them. Because there are some comments that aren't spam. They'll just be like asking me questions or they'll say, you know, oh, that pillow you got in the background is beautiful. Or, oh, look at Mr. Bumbles, your beautiful rabbit. You know, I had comments about Bumbles the rabbit that went to spam box and I don't even know why. So I just approved them, you know. So. I'm not sure why some of them are ended up in spam. Maybe they spam somebody else and then they just automatically get spammed in my box. I'm not sure. But I just want to thank every, every last one of you. And I spent way too much money on all of you. I almost think maybe I should split this up and have two winners. I don't know. I don't know if I should have two winners. I'm so confused. I don't know. I think I'd probably just have one and just call it a day. One big winner. One big winner. Uh, and you're going to be a really big winner because this crap wasn't cheap. Not at all. Um, so I really hope you like it. And if you don't, you know, give it to someone you know will like it. I'm pretty sure you'll find someone who likes this stuff if you don't. Uh, I try to be a little different because I watched some other subscriber videos and a lot of them were all pretty much the same. Like makeup brushes, the same kind of makeup. I mean, I do have makeup, but I want to get different kind of stuff that go with it. I don't know. Because everybody, every girl likes makeup. And I know not all my subscribers are men. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, but I'm hoping that if a guy wins, you know, like I said, like we said earlier, if a guy wins, hopefully you can give it to um, your significant other, girlfriend, wife, fiance, um, maybe even if you have a daughter, I'm pretty sure she would love this stuff. Your mom would love this stuff. Your sister, your auntie, because your auntie, your grandma. Well, but. Thank you so much for watching. Stick with me. Thank you to the new subscribers to our channel. Please check out our other videos. Um, like, comment, share, subscribe. Welcome to our channel. You are now a honeybee. Um, and I think that's it. Bye, everybody. Bye. Gosh, here is crazy.